All right, folks, this is our seventh day of traveling. Uh, we overnighted a uh, Petro here in uh, just south of Elizabethtown, Kentucky. And uh, we're getting ready to get our day started this morning. So join us, see where we're going. Still uh, checking on the camps as we go down. And uh, we'll see what we're going to do. Bear with us. We'll catch you on the other side. We're getting off here at exit 53, gonna go to South Central Kentucky. Uh, it's gonna uh, bypass around Nashville, so I think this is the way to go when you get out and do the drive. Uh, having decided if we're gonna make our camp today where we're headed to, or if we're gonna make it in the morning, tomorrow. So bear with us. Get off here at Cave City. I think we're heading towards Glasgow. Take y'all on the other side. Hi, right, folks. Here we are on back roads in central Kentucky. We're uh, making a diagonal cut over towards Interstate 40 in Tennessee. And we're just doing what we're doing. I prefer back roads, anyways. Uh, it's not as crowded. You take your time and see things that you wouldn't. Uh, normally see if he's on the interstate. So bear with us. Here we go. Let's see what we'll get into. We just crossed over a Tennessee state line, and here we are. <sighs> Probably about another 100 miles to go down here where we're going to, in central Tennessee. Bale Hollow Lake, huh? Uh-huh. So, bear with us. Let's continue our journey. We're back on Interstate 40, heading east. We'll go over here and buy another 14 miles, get off again, and go back uh, back roads into where we're going to. So get ready, and I'll show y'all, tell y'all more when we get there. Uh, figure out what our plans are going to be. And here we go.
right, folks, we're coming up on our last uh, little bit here going into Rhea Springs is where we're going to camp at. So uh, enjoy the rest of the little drive here going into it. You'll see the sign here in a little bit. Uh, enjoy the photos, and I'll catch up with y'all at the end and let y'all know about what's going on here, how long we're going to be here. And uh, we'll catch you on the other side of this and in the photos. Hey folks, that's gonna be it. That's the uh, we have made our destination here at Raya Springs. Hope you enjoyed the photos of the uh, of the camping area. The last photo is where our camp's at. Um, this is open uh, free camping. They do have uh, showers here and toilets, flushable toilets. Uh, it's a small one shower, but um, uh, you might, if you're handicapped, you might want to take a little caution. You know, going in uh, into the shower, uh, they don't have a handy handicap bathroom either. So, you know, uh, be aware of that. Uh, uh, they do keep it clean. They do have people that come through here monitoring what's going on. Um, here at the lake and um the only downside is we're only going to uh, we're only going to be able to stay here about three or four days because they're closing up for the season uh this camp here free camp uh, Rhea springs will be closed up uh i think it's around the 12th of uh september until uh mid-april or our uh, the first weekend of may as well is what the guy said so um keep it in mind it's a good place to come back for the spring you know uh nice temperatures here uh, uh at the beginning of the fall uh, enjoy it and uh so we're going to enjoy our uh, camping here and then we'll go on over uh a little bit further to the east and uh do our next camp so uh, hey i appreciate y'all hanging out with me uh this long and um welcome to you new subscribers if you haven't subscribed yet hit that button down there my little watermark and the notification let you know when I upload a new video. So for now, y'all stay safe, keep smiling, uh, stay healthy. We'll catch y'all on the other side.